what's been going on with you lately, man? Oh shit! What hadn't been going on with us? We've been busy as hell. Um, we started this tour on May 5th, I think, in Belgium, and did 11 shows over there in 12 days, seven countries or so, with King Parrot from Melbourne, Australia. Kick-ass dudes, man. Great friends of ours now. After this, they're our brothers. You know, we just did six weeks with them, so we did those. 11 shows over there, flew home for a day, and then started the U.S. leg of it, which was 27 shows in 28 days. So we've been moving. Wow. And good. this is the last show tonight here at home, and we are done. All right. Well. Done and for a month, and then we go back to Europe for a festival circuit and shit. Hellfest and all that's on that, right? Temple starts it, and Hellfest ends it, yep. Well, I know I heard uh, Claw of the Sloth uh -huh. off your new CD. Uh-huh. Man, that sounds good, man. I can't wait to hear it all. When's that coming out? Uh, it was supposed to be out in a couple days, 420, but uh, some shit got happened with the, the graphic design and all that shit on it. We were done with the record, but uh, now it's coming out on the 18th of... Uh, I don't even know what fucking month it is. Probably May. I just said we started this tour in May, but we started <laughs> the tour in March. <laughs> May's coming up. Let me have another shot of bourbon. <laughs> hey, let me uh, we're we're going to, uh, yeah, the record comes out the 18th in Europe and I think the 19th in the States of, of May, or either it's backwards the other way around, but two days apart, day apart. And uh, we start the festival circuit over there, you know, to, in support of it. Come back here, and I think we do uh, fly-ins for the West Coast run, and then an East Coast run, and then that's all we have planned tentatively right now. Except for November, we're supposed to go do Australia, so and New Zealand. Okay. Hopefully, with these parrot boys, they're awesome. They are. We just caught them just the first time seeing them. Yeah, man. They're, they're they're great dudes. We've been living with them for the past six weeks, you know. So, yeah. Well, um, with your new CD coming out, uh, what's some other songs that we got to look forward to? I think I've only heard that Sloth and then one of Cain and Abler. Yeah. Um, yeah, there's, it's it's cool, man. There's some weird acoustic stuff on there and a gospel hymn to start it out, you know, like some weird shit. Yeah. Um, one of my favorite tracks on there is Claw. Um, there's another track, Bow Down, that's probably one of my favorites. And I think they're going to release one more streaming, this, this song, Bully, that's up-tempo for us anyway, faster stuff. But, um... Damn, the whole thing came together good. We're stoked on it. So, uh, the label that we're working with out of France, uh, they're from Marseille, France, Season of Mist. Those dudes are awesome. They all showed up at the show last night in Philly because they have an office and their U.S. office is in Philadelphia. That's so, Enrique, right? Enrique is the, is the is their PR dude. Anyone that was trying to get to do an interview or anything would have went through Enrique. Yeah. Yeah. I saw him last night in Philadelphia. Great dude. Uh, that's cool. That's why I didn't get back with him. <laughs> yeah, probably so. You probably had him a buzz on. <laughs> well, uh, uh, y'all gonna do anything else with COC with Pepper back in the band? Has there been any? We talked about a little bit if they continue to do that. They're doing the Blind Reunion too, which is the other lineup too. Really? Um, but we've we've played with every incarnation of it. You know, but as far as we played with the blind setup back in the day, and we played with you know on the in the arm store, which was them doing deliverance stuff and all that, and then we played shows with the with the three piece too. You know, so um, yeah, man, they're our boys, Woody and, and Mike and Reed, and all them are our boys as well as Pepper, and you know we've done the down tour and stuff, so we know them dudes really well, and we'd love to do some more shit with them. I'm, we were talking about it in Manchester. We just saw them over there in, in the UK, and we had played the same city on the same day but across town we were lucky enough to be able to go over and visit with them for a minute but yeah we, we we'll be doing some more stuff with them if we can iron it out that's cool i know uh gosh we we listened to you way back when y'all the monkey junction songs and uh, man can y'all still do all that good stuff? man we uh we do some old stuff just because we feel like we got to and just because we love it and um we're gonna do monkey junction tonight so which we is which is that's probably the oldest song we're doing tonight, you know. That's off the first record, so, you know. I've been singing it for the last three or four days, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're gonna sing it this evening. Yeah, well, uh, tell me something about that Man Coon video y'all did a long time ago, yeah, man. That's the funniest the, damn thing yeah, to watch. We shot that in Hampstead. It's like, supposed to be fucking weird B-horror movie slash part Scooby-Doo, part Three Stooges, fucking, you just ridiculous bullshit, you know, that 
that we thought was funny. Big ass sandwiches and cow <laughs> tongues and fucking who knows, you know. But we did that in Hampstead up around Jimmy Ellington's place where the skate barn is. The old weed eater house was there. So we filmed all the interiors in that house. And then the exteriors are filmed all around the swamps back there and shit, which those Cypress streets just look so awesome on film, man. You can't fuck with it. it does, it does. And, then, and then the live, actual live band footage that's on it, we did that same day at Reggie's. So we did the whole thing in one day. Did all that in the morning and then filmed at night at Reggie's for the for the live footage. And of course we love Reggie's. Yeah. Oh, I'm not wearing my Reggie shirt anymore. <laughs> I was. So y'all aren't doing man coon tonight? Yeah, we're gonna do you it. You gotta do that one. Yeah, we'll do it. Yeah. Yeah. It's about a part man, part raccoon, part man coon. That's him. There you go. Anything else you like? Ain't no flies on that shit. <laughs> I would like to add that we do this for ourselves, but if you happen to like it, awesome. If you don't, like I said, we do it for ourselves, so fuck off. <laughs> Please buy the new record, that being said, and come see Weed Eater. I think it's a better live show than it'll ever be on record, and I think you'd say the same thing. Well, anything with uh, Buzz Oven anymore with Kurt? Yeah, I talked to Kurt recently, and we're talking about doing some, some more reunion shows and stuff. He doesn't want to tour a whole lot and do like a bunch of shows in a row, like the kind of shit we do, but maybe, you know, seven shows up the East Coast, seven shows down the West Coast, whatever. We'll probably be putting something together real shortly on as far as that goes, yep. Yeah. Yeah, that was in days you played in both bands, same night. Mm -hmm. Yeah, used to do it all the time. Been there playing three in one damn night, man. Well, all right, man. Hard damn work. Looking so pretty. <laughs> Appreciate you doing this with us, man. No problem. <clears throat> if I don't see y'all again until it rains, piss on you. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, man.